Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another episode here on the Iron Man profile. I'm actually really pumped for this one. We're going to be doing a ton more of red gift fishing, opening up a couple hundred red gifts, and honestly getting some pretty cracked fishing RNG along the way. I'm talking like things I just haven't seen ever, and it's happening to me, so that's pretty cool. So if you guys are excited for that, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe channel if you guys are new around here. Without further ado, though, let's jump right into this one. It should be a fun one. Before we get fully underway, though, if you do find yourself checking out on the Hypixel store, currently there's a bunch of holiday sales going on. It's seriously like the best time to be buying something on the Hypixel store. Don't forget to use creator code Zach on checkout, that is Z-A-C-H, for an extra 5% off on top of all those amazing sales. So don't forget to take advantage. Seriously, it's like the best Best time of year to buy stuff on the store i do greatly appreciate all your support and without further ado on to today's episode so you know me i've been fishing for some red gifts and actually caught a water hydra followed by a sea emperor so i got a skull i got a shredder i got a water hydra head i also got a fish of fandy talisman which i sold for a thousand coins because i really can't do anything else with it but just like a crazy turn of events just getting every drop under the sun except for what i'm looking for which is those red gifts so i mean i'll take it extra stuff right but we still need so many red gifts. We need so many North Stars. This grind is quite intensive. Oh my goodness, it happened again. Another Baby Yeti. Another Baby Yeti pet. <laughs> uh, I mean, I'm not even like Sorrow Swapping or Magic Find Swapping. Like, I'm just killing it with what I'm wearing because I, I just don't need Baby Yeti pets anymore. I, I, they really give me no value, but um, yeah, we'll take it. An another epic? Why, why not at this point? Seriously, that is... That is actually the motto of the story, I guess. Why not? Bro, someone spawned a tier 5 Revenant Horror in, like, my fishing pond. What is going on here? This is wild. Hello? Like, y'all good? Why? Why Why do you turn off your auto slayer, bro, when you aren't doing slayers? Please. Actually beg. Well, now that that's been averted, uh, back to fishing, I guess. I was just fishing away, and I got the message in my chat. Some random guy gifted a snowman pet to someone else and this guy said zach crying right now honestly he he, he just isn't wrong and i'm, I'm kind of mad about it but gg's um that's definitely something i want i would be really happy if we get one by the time we get all the north stars we need we still need an actual ton i need to get my hands on a tier 12 snow and ice minion as well as the equipment pieces we are making really good progress though i have like another stack of red gifts to open already and i have over 200 north stars on me so Progress is being made. It's just it's just taking some time. A lot of fishing required. I got another one. Literally another epic baby yeti pets. I I have actually gotten so many of these things the last couple days. It's kind of ridiculous, but it was actually one I fished up myself, so I did not leech it. I have three epic baby yeti pets all sitting in my inventory here. I wish I could sell them for a decent price, but I honestly just can't. So I think I'm just gonna hold on to them as like a little bit of a flex, considering it's on Iron Man. But yeah. Kind of insane that I've gotten like three epic baby Eddie pets in the last couple days. Um, let me know what you guys think I should do with it in the comments down below. Do I like, I don't know, put them in my pets menu, put them in a chest somewhere in my in my backpacks. I actually don't know what to do with them. Seriously. So please let me know. So as you can probably assume, I was just fishing and I caught an epic guardian pet. Um, I can't remember what rarity my original guardian pet was that I ended up leveling to level 100 and upgrading the ledge, but... Pretty sure it wasn't legendary, so this actually might be the highest rarity guardian pet I've fished up on this profile, not gonna lie. I also have a couple other ones in here that I've been getting recently. I have an common, a common, and now this epic guardian. So, not really anything I can do with it, but I guess just another pet to hold on, or to boost the net worth. But may as well hold on to it. Maybe I'll see how much George wants to give me for it, but um, yeah, we'll take it. It is now time to open up the red gifts. I actually have like 125 of them. I have two or 129, sorry, over two stacks. I got Yaddy here from the guild. So I'm basically just going to go ahead, bam down some presents. There's a little bit of a cooldown every once in a while, but just going to try and chug through these as fast as possible and see what we get. So obviously we're looking for North Stars. We're starting at about 200 we're going to see what we're at after a little over two stacks of these things. Basically two stacks of red gifts. And who knows, maybe we'll get something cool along the way. So, yeah, let's just open these and uh, we'll be right back. And last few red gifts. Honestly, did not get anything fancy during that at all. Um, that's it. Thank you. Shout out to Yaddy for uh, leaving Boy Slayer to come and open these with me. 
do appreciate it. Um, we got like a million coins. We didn't get any fancy drops, but we did go up nearly 200 North Stars. I feel like I was even low in that regard. I just feel like those presents really didn't give me all that I could have expected even on an average. So I, I don't know. I feel like it was a very lackluster opening. Um, I, mean, I guess that's what happens when you don't really get like an RNG drop. That's probably like the most I've opened without getting an RNG drop since this update came out or like one of the Santa tier drops. But we do have a lot of North Stars now, um, including enough to actually buy some of the last things that we need from the North Star Shop. So honestly, I think we should do that because then we're only going to have one item left. And I think you guys know what I'm talking about. So one of the things we need to upgrade is our Ice Minion. I currently have one at tier 11 shugging away on my island. Even put a Mithril Infusion on this thing. It's like the first time I've ever put it down. But we can actually finally upgrade this thing to tier 12, which is amazing. That's going to be huge another tier 12 minion basically uh this one isn't as expensive as the snow minion it is it does require a tier 11 ice minion 1024 enchant ice a million coins and 300 north stars so let me actually make a little bit of inventory room because i do need to put a bunch of enchanted ice into my inventory so let's go ahead and dump a couple of things into this chest here there we go and let's go ahead and take out 1024 enchanted ice so i believe that's 16 stacks so one two four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen the perfect amount of space and i actually have a potion here i can sell too so i'll actually be able to do the trade 300 north stars a million coins 16 stacks of enchanted ice and the ice minion tier 11 to get a tier 12 ice minion and my goodness there we go it actually leveled up my skyblock level level 232 that is beautiful to see really really happy about that not gonna lie the last things i need from here are the tier 12 snow minion which is 500 north stars and i also need the snow equipment which is only 40 north stars so honestly i think we're just gonna go ahead and buy this so let's get the cloak the belt the gloves and the necklace and the main reason why i wanted to do that as well is because i made the mistake the other day of taking my snow stuff out of the museum i think i already have the contribution for it but i no longer can put my snowsuit back in there so let's grab out a brand new snow set snowsuit as well as all these equipment pieces we're gonna go to the museum really quickly and we're gonna be able to tuck these away for a while i don't know when i'll ever need them i guess during the jerry workshop attack i might be needing those but there we go now we have the snowsuit in there as well as all the equipment that looks super clean and then obviously we have our nutcracker set in here as well right now so that's really cool. That's all the stuff from the update, though, in terms of the new armor pieces. And uh, it's, I think it's really cool that they're kind of making it so you have to put equipment in there, too. I do, however, wish that it was in, like, rarities or a whole other section so I could at least get some more Skyblock XP because, you know me. I, I love my Skyblock XP. What can I say? But really good progress on the Skyblock level. We're 169th of all Iron Man players making really good progress. So really nice to see it level up. Oh, my God. Leached ledge baby yeti what is that i leached a ledge baby yeti uh that is actually ridiculous that is just actually ridiculous wow that is okay well i mean i guess i'll take it that that's gross i actually still can't believe i just i just dropped one i think that's the first pure ledge yeti i've got on this profile um kind of ridiculous i mean during this like event i guess you could say of the month of december of like red gift fishing i've gotten four baby yeti pets now a ledge and three epics not to mention i already have a ledge baby yeti pet which i've leveled up a decent amount in my pets menu already let me show you where my pets baby yeti level 93 ledge baby yeti that is gross i have five baby yeti pets now um kind of ridiculous so yeah pretty happy about that um i wish i could sell this for 16 mil That'd be pretty nice, not gonna lie, but but I can't. So I'll, I'll just hold on to it. I'll put them into like a backpack or ender chest page just to just to flex on everyone, I guess, of how many baby Eddie pets I've gotten. But wow, that is actually ridiculous. I am genuinely printing these things out. That is that is insane. So I just did a little bit more fishing, got my hands on 25 more red gifts, and I figured I may as well open them before I go to bed instead of saving them for the next episode. So let's go ahead and open these bad boys. Uh, basically, just go walk around this crowd of random people I found in the hub of the jerry's workshop and hope that we get something and maybe bless someone's day you know it once these kids figure out how to open these things they are slowly but surely I'm, I'm really proud of them there's some character development going on here really quickly but uh so far nothing too fancy just a couple of north stars honestly not even a good amount of north stars that's always a little bit concerning 
My pickup stash is full. Gonna have to sell a couple of these potions. Let's drop these off. Slash pick up stash. Just like so. Uh, did I get everything? I still allegedly have one more item in there. Okay, slash pick up stash one more time. Oh, I, I had one more red gift chilling in there. So let's go ahead and uh, give it to this guy here. Um, oh, apparently you can't even gift them when you're... I just know that's not true, but let's go ahead and dump off the runes. There you go, buddy. There's the last one. Open that bad boy up. Beautiful. And 500 alchemy. So honestly, nothing too good. Not even the law nor stars. Just uh, disappointing from the red gifts today, not gonna lie, but the Yeti pets do make up for it. So unfortunately, that is gonna bring us to the end of today's episode, though. Hopefully you guys did end up enjoying it. We leveled up our Skyblock level, got our hands on a tier 12 Ice Minion for the first time on the profile, which is super exciting. Might even try to go for some extra ones once I do get my Snow Minion to tier 12. That is the last thing we have left to do. We need 500 North Stars is the final grind. It's the longest one, it's the most expensive thing, but man, I'm ready for it. Hopefully you guys have been enjoying these jerry workshop event type videos uh we're really close to getting it done then we'll be back to regularly scheduled mining and dungeons and i really want hype so that's our next big goal after this is all wrapped up but thank you so much for watching can't wait to see you guys in the next one don't forget to leave a like and subscribe if you did enjoy check out my other socials like my discord in the description down below if you want to stay up to date on everything going on in the community and don't forget to use code zach on checkout so without further ado can't wait to see you guys in the next one take care and peace out